Security forces in the West African country of Burkina Faso launched an assault on a hotel in the capital where a number of hostages were being held by suspected Islamist militants who'd attacked earlier. There are reports of 20 people dead and many more injured after the militants struck the Hotel Splendid in Ouagadougou. By 4 o'clock GMT, 30 hostages had been freed, according to a government minister, who also said 33 people were being treated in hospital. The initial attack started at around half past seven local time on Friday evening, when witnesses say at least three gunmen started firing in the air outside the hotel. The Hotel Splendid is located just outside the business district near to the airport. It's well used by Westerners and NGO workers, as well as Burkino's officials. Witnesses report two loud explosions, which they say were the result of two car bombs. The gunmen stormed the hotel and shots could be heard coming from inside the building. The security forces arrived a short time later and engaged in what witnesses described as an intense exchange of gunfire with the attackers. Many of the wounded civilians were taken to hospital, where they told staff that they'd seen at least 20 people lying dead at the scene. There's been no official confirmation of that figure. The security forces secured the perimeter and then appear to have become involved in a standoff with the attackers who'd taken hostages inside the hotel. The group Al-Qaeda in the Islamic Maghreb said its members had carried out the attack, making the claim before the incident was even over. The authorities declared a curfew and the security forces waited for the order to assault the hotel. At around 1am GMT, a fire was seen in the lobby of the hotel and a short time later, the assault started.